And now to a morning original. These are stories you'll see first here on Wake Up Central. A world renowned surgeon, one of six people about to be inducted into the Arkansas Black Hall of Fame. From her humble beginnings to a life dedicated to helping women beat breast cancer. Wake Up Central's Journey Taylor joins us now with this woman's incredible story. Journey, good morning. Good morning. It will be a sweet evening where the late Mr. James Leary, Mr. Harvey Wiley Sr., Judge Joyce Williams Warren, Reverend Jerry Black, and Dr. Rhonda Henry Tillman will be honored for their many achievements nationally and internationally. I was able to sit down with Dr. Rhonda Henry Tillman ahead of her induction to learn more about the woman behind all the titles. I'm living my legacy now and you're looking at who you know who I am. Legacies and inductions to Hall of Fames often are talked about or done once a person has achieved all they've put their mind to. But I'm not done. You yeah. know, I'm, I'm still, we still have a lot to do. Still punching the clock and walking the halls of the Winthrop P. Rockefeller Cancer Institute. Dr. Rhonda Sherletta Henry Tillman is the Division Chief of Breast Oncology and the Executive Vice Chair in the Department of Surgery at the College of Medicine at UAMS. But who is the woman behind the titles? I was actually born on the Air Force Base. Born in the small northeast Arkansas town of Blavel. A middle child with six siblings, she will take off for California at the age of 16 to live with her Aunt Ruth and Uncle Willie Fireson for a fresh start. So you think, oh, maybe I could be a movie star, or, you know. It was the California dream, or so she thought. Her first job was at the cleaners, but it was a little too hot for her. Up next, the grocery store. More than minimum wage, and you got all these benefits, health insurance, and I just thought, oh, this is going to be my career. But her aunt had a better idea, college, and she did, eventually enrolling in pre-med. She graduated in 1992, and fate brought her back to her home state for her residency. And I matched here, and I'm glad that they chose me. And, um, you know, as I always say, God's grace has put you where he wants you to be. And I met my husband here, had my children here, I built my career here. She's made a difference in specializing in breast cancer, named best doctors in America multiple times, a recipient of the prestigious Muriel Balsam Comb Chair in Breast Surgical Oncology at UMS, and has even trained surgeons across the world in Congo. She does it all. All the people that have come across my path have meant so much and have done so much for me to be where I am here today. I never claim anything alone. Thankful for her community and her community now looking to show its thanks. Brings tears to my eyes, you know. Why? Yeah. Um, because, you know, when I left Arkansas, I never thought, I never had the vision. Like you asked me my, if I go back and look at myself, this is not where I saw myself. For the little girl or boy watching now, her message is simple. I believe in you and don't be afraid to dream big and don't be afraid to go for it all. And of course, if you would like to attend this year's induction ceremony, it's happening this Saturday. Mm -hmm. You can still purchase tickets. We'll put that information on our website later today at THV11.com. What an amazing accomplishment. Mm -hmm. She comes back home. Never thought she was going to come no. back and look what she's done. A movie star. <laughs> Working at the grocery yeah. store and look at her now. What? They should make a movie about her life. <laughs> yeah. That would be amazing. Excellent point. She's globally recognized, mm -hmm. published, uh, research, you name it. And Journey, you'll be there Saturday? Yes, I will be there with all the inductees. And is everyone coming to shower them and honor them? Right here, here's the camera. Um, but yes, absolutely. I, I'm excited to I'm be in that room with all of them. for you. Yes, you deserve to be there as well. Yeah. And what these Arkansans are just giving about. It's incredible. It's amazing to see and it's so well deserved. So well deserved. I agree. Mm. <laughs> oh, you did us proud. Thank you. Thank you.